The Peace Region's best music mix, Peace FM. That was local musician uh, Niska Napoleon, who's from the Peace Region, with her song, On My Way Again. And a couple of cool facts about her. She's completed two cross-Canada headlining tours without a release, and she recently made the CBC Nine Canadian Musicians You Need to Know list. How's it going today, Niska? I'm so excited. I just got some really big news about a big gig that I got coming up. So I'm like so stoked about that. It's the Honda Celebration of Lights in Vancouver on August the 4th. And they expect between 500,000 and a million people. So it'll be my biggest show yet. So I'm super excited Ex- about that. Excellent. That That is so exciting to yeah. hear. Lots of big things yes, happening for you. Yes. So tell me about the song we just played, On My Way Again. Can I ask what inspired that song? Oh my goodness. Okay, when I do this song live, I try not to cry, but I cry almost every time. I actually wrote it on a songwriting hiatus when I was in Moberly Lake, and I hadn't been home in about six years. And I just finished touring with my 10-piece reggae rock band, and and I broke up with my boyfriend who was in the band, and I kind of went to Moberly to kind of decompress or whatever, and and there was no cell reception or Wi-Fi at the time, so I was just feeling really secluded from the world, and I was looking out on Moberly Lake, and it was like, you know, pure white, everything covered in snow, and then at that very moment when I was like, oh my god, the sun came up behind the mountains and kind of just warmed my entire body, and, and I felt like it was a sign like everyone from my home who had passed away came to greet me in the warmth of the sun and just let me know you know like Niska we're here with you you're not alone and you're never gonna have to feel alone and so the song kind of wrote itself from that moment so that I could hold on to the feeling to never kind of be afraid and and never worry about feeling lonely and just look up and and so that power is essentially what I wanted to capture in that song. Excellent. Would you say that music is something that's healing for you? or Oh, it's definitely healing. I feel like I never really developed social skills or um, even communication skills. Um, and I think it's quite common in reserve communities where communication is just kind of non-existent. And so for me, being able to perform gave me a voice. And so in that way, especially when it comes to songwriting, it's an opportunity for me to to say what's inside of myself. And I think that is super healing more than anything else I've ever done. And you've been performing music for most of your life. Uh, You've been part of the Napoleon Collective with members of your family. You sang in the ska band Rocky Rebel Mountain Music, as well as your own solo work. What made you want to uh, per, what made you want to pursue a career in music? I knew from a very young age. I think I was seven or eight at the time. I saw my dad, Art Napoleon, perform at the Edmonton Folk Fest. And once I saw him on stage and I saw him come off stage and the people come up to him after the show, I was just like, that's what I'm going to do. And so I think I've been pursuing it ever since then. And uh, your song, Step by Step, that was actually written by our boss, Leo Sabolsky. Yeah. Uh, what can you tell me about that song? Oh, I was just really, I think that was like my first radio gig, you could say. I, I must have been in grade five or six at the time. And uh, it was just like a really cool experience to be able, probably my first time um, recording someone else's music in the studio. And what's happening next for you musically? Are, uh, is there an album that we can expect? Or? My debut kind of album EP is set for release at the end of October this year. And where can people go to hear more of your music? You can go to niskanapoleon.com. And this next song, Enough, it sounds like there's elements of salsa, R&B, and pop. Do you think it's important for musicians to expand their musical horizons? Uh, yeah, definitely. I It's really hard for me to classify my genre just because I, f- I feel like almost all of my songs are in a completely different genre. I don't really stick to one thing and I think that that's just, I go with how the song makes me feel and how what inspires me to write the song and usually it's it just it kind of goes everywhere and it's it's more about for me capturing a feeling and an emotion and trying to project that feeling so that others can feel the same thing and and I think that is you know genre un- limitless excellent well thank you so much for taking the time to speak with me today thank you and here is Niska Napoleon with her song enough on peace fm